With the Learn Dash Course Planner Pro add-on, you can schedule when your courses, lessons, topics and quizzes become visible to your students, allowing you to drip content. In this video, we'll walk you through the steps to plan your courses using this add-on. The first thing you need to do is install and activate the add-on. Once you do this, you will see a course management section appear on the WordPress dashboard menu. From here, you can initially configure the add-on settings. In the settings page, you can select whether you want to use the add-on's calendar to select dates when the content will be visible or hidden. If you choose the show on specified dates option, you will set dates to determine when content becomes visible to the user. If you choose the hide on specific dates option, you will schedule dates that the content is hidden from the user. You can also enable the option to hide content from users that are not on the allowed users list. Simply enable hidden for all users. Another excellent feature is the send course availability email option to send a notification email to your students, letting them know when the content will be available to them. You also have the option to hide unavailable courses from the course listing page. Finally, it is important that you select a time zone according to which your Learn Dash content will be scheduled. Configure messages. Once you have updated the general settings, you can then set messages that will be displayed when the user tries to access scheduled content. You can configure messages to be displayed according to the scheduling modality you have chosen, show or hide. For example, when a course is not yet available, you can add a message like one seen here. You can also add a message to be displayed on a page that a user is not allowed to see based on the hide from all users option. For example, you can add a message like this to display to a user that is not on the allowed list for a course, lesson, topic or quiz. Or you might want to add messages to inform users that content isn't available because the parent course, lesson or topic is hidden. These messages are configured separately for courses, lessons, topics and quizzes in their corresponding tabs. Schedule content. You can schedule your content by selecting calendar from the course management section. On the left hand side, you will see a list of all the created courses. Clicking on the plus sign next to any course will allow you to view lessons associated with that specific course. Similarly, to view the related topics and quizzes associated with the specific lesson, you have to click the plus sign next to each lesson. Select any course, lesson, topic or quiz you want to show or hide on a specific date or dates and drag and drop that to the specific date on the calendar. Depending on the general settings selected, these dates will determine when the course is visible or hidden. Additionally, you can schedule content according to its category or tag. To do this, on the left-hand side of the calendar, click on the Schedule Course by Category or Tag option. Next, a pop-up window will appear. Here, select a starting date and time, include or exclude users or user roles, and finally, select a category or tag. You can also set an end date and time for the scheduling settings of the content. To do this, select the scheduled content from the calendar, which will open a new pop-up window. Here, enable the option, do you want to set the end date or time, and select the end date and enter the time. From this same pop-up window, you can configure additional options, like making the user's enrollment date as the scheduled course start date. To do this, enable the course subscription date as start date option. Then enter the interval number by selecting a time period in days, months or years from the drop down menu. The pop up window also gives you the option to conditionally display content based on user roles or by a specific user. You can also schedule content for a specific LearnDash group. To include user roles, select include and then select which user role you want to hide or show content from the include user role option. To include users, select include and then enter the selected username on the include users field. Multiple usernames can be added. To exclude users, select exclude and then enter the selected usernames on the exclude users field. Allow group leaders and site administrators to schedule content on the front end. You can show a calendar and message tabs on the front end using short code on any page to schedule content. Keep in mind that only users with LearnDash group leader roles will be able to view this page content. Display course schedule. LearnDash Course Planner Pro widget allows you to display the available or unavailable scheduled dates for the user's enrolled courses, lessons, topics and quizzes. 
To add the Learn Dash Course Planner Pro widget, you have to navigate to Appearance from the WordPress Admin Dashboard. Then drag the Learn Dash Course Planner Pro widget from the available widgets and drop it into the desired location. On the widgets configuration options, enter the message to be displayed when content is available and unavailable. By going through these steps, you can successfully schedule all of your Learn Dash course content according to your needs, saving time and effort in your course management. Thanks for watching.